What does your new job entail? Well, it involved me going out, talking to young people, going to schools, talking to people on the street in general, finding out what problems young people face today, what they think are the most important things to sort of address, as well as talking to police as well, trying to find out what the problems are between police and young people today, try and gap that bridge. And how, what do you hope to achieve if you, know, if you find out that then young people in your area aren't very happy with some of the things that the police are doing? What are you going to do about it? Well, I'm going to be getting all that feedback. I, I want to find out what they think the most important issues are to address. And I'll be taking all that back to Anne, the commissioner, and then she'll be able to say, right, this needs to change, this needs to be done, and then she'll be able to implement the changes herself. And how are you going to meet all these people? Well, I'll be going to schools, like I said. I'll be talking to people on the street in general. I'm perfectly comfortable talking to strangers. So I'll just be going to anyone, anywhere, everywhere. Um, now, a lot of people have said you're fantastic. They don't have a problem with you, but they think the police shouldn't really have employed you. you should, they should be doing the job themselves because that's what they're paid for. And they've obviously got an awful lot more experience than you because you're just out of school. What do you say to that? Well, who better to talk to other young people than a young person themselves? I am 17 today. So it's, it's much easier for me to talk to other people similar to my age than it would be for maybe an adult too because young people have changed dramatically over the last 10 years. People grow up a lot quicker than they used to. What about the real troublemakers though? Is it going to be hard to talk to them? There's always going to be difficulties, but I'm, I like a challenge. But it is so much easier to open up to someone who is a familiar age to you than it would be to an adult. And just briefly, do you, are you going to be a police officer when you're older or a politician? What do you reckon? I'd consider a career in politics. I'd consider it. Okay, well, best of luck. Let us know how you get on, Thank Paris. You very Thanks much. so much for joining us tonight.